see hey Beverly <laughs> unmute you Hi. hey so I know some other girls are gonna be jumping on here so um, I'm gonna be going back and forth to some stuff that I have saved up and so I'm gonna jump right in because um, there's a lot to cover tonight and I'm recording this because I do it every every first Monday and then I will be able to share it with the whole team so I'm going to go right back to a few things, um, and then we'll see who else is with us. But we're going to check out a video from Cindy. So let's go to here. Okay. Oops. Hold on. Let's try this again. We're going to try it again in just a minute. Hold on. <laughs> Let's see if it works this time. Hello, everyone, and welcome to your October Better Together meeting. Thank you for investing in your business and investing in yourself to kick off the most wonderful time of the year for 31. Our new holiday gift guide launches this week, and it's filled with the core 31 products that your customers already love alongside new limited time styles that they'll be adding to their wish list this year. Our goal today is to help you to leverage your marketing and sponsoring skills along with our gift guides, online quizzes, and other tools to start new conversations with your customers and to make this the best holiday season that you've ever had. Ladies, this is a season of opportunity. 
opportunity for your business. Your customers and hostesses are looking for thoughtful gifts for their family and friends. And you have the opportunity to be their personal shopper, helping them to complete their wish list. You might also have women in your life who are looking for a new way to help pay off those holiday bills. And you have the opportunity to share 31 with them this season. With the holidays, this season has the most sales potential for a new consultant. And it helps her with all her friends and family to fulfill their Christmas wish list. With new and limited time products, new consultants have so many opportunities to start new conversations with their customers. In this season, we have one more way that you can start the opportunity conversation with potential new team members. It's our limited time passing essential kit. For one month only, through October 31st, new consultants can join and receive a kit of five for and holiday products, plus select business supplies for just $50 in the U.S. and $60 in Canada. Not only is the kit an amazing value on its own, but as always, we are purposeful in choosing products to maximize her earning potential from day one. She'll get our all-time bestseller, the large utility tote, as well as the versatile mini zipper pouch and a statement canvas pillow cover, a popular gifting style for the season. And for our holiday gift guide, she'll get the keepin' cozy scarf and a little cereal caddy in cool cutie. With this kit, she can choose how she parties, either face-to-face -face or online. And she has the opportunity to earn even more free products through Start Swell and with Hostess Rewards at her launch party. She'll have flexibility in how she runs her business from the start. Remember, this kit is available for a limited time only. So take advantage of this opportunity to build your team and experience all the benefits that come from being a leader. In just a few minutes, we'll spend time celebrating you and your accomplishments over the past few months. But we're celebrating as a company as well. It will be our 14th anniversary this October, which means the countdown is on to our 15th anniversary. Throughout the next year, we'll be celebrating our achievements as a company, past and future. But most importantly, we'll be celebrating you and how you're contributing to our success. From now until October 2018, we'll be celebrating you with fun surprises, new products, and exciting new incentives. And you may have already heard about the first one. This October, when you submit at least $1,000 in the dollars, you'll be earning our new Cindy Toe Limited in Black Beauty Dottie Pebble for free. Ladies, this is the signature piece from our new online exclusive collection and one that is already creating big buzz in the field. This year at conference, I challenge you to set a goal of an additional thousand dollars in personal volume each month. Start with the thousand dollars Cindy Toe incentive in your after great start. This product incentive is an easy way to hold yourself accountable to that goal and be rewarded when you reach it. So are you ready to rock October and beyond? I'm confident that with the tools we're giving you today, you can work to reach your goals this season. Thank you so much for being a part of the 31 family, and thank you for being here today. Enjoy your meeting, and I'll see you all real soon. Okay. All right, so we've had a couple more ladies join us. All right, so... Super excited about a lot of stuff that's coming up. So I'm going to try to um, just kind of stay on task and keep moving because there's a lot of things I want to cover. So that's right. Um, this October, we are going to be having um, the, our 14th anniversary. And then when we, uh, when we move into between now and next year, we're just celebrating all the way through because once that 15th um, anniversary comes up, that's going to be super exciting. So everything from now to conference, all of those things are going to be just a lot of fun. And I'm excited about like how they're going to start throwing out these incentives and fun surprises. Um, just like this thousand dollar goal for the month of October so that you can get that Cindy tote, which I am super stoked about. 
honestly, as soon as I heard that I got, I just started making phone calls and texting and following up with people that I've been needing to follow up with because I don't ever assume that I'm going to sell a thousand dollars. I know that I'm going to have to work for that. So I hope that you're going to do it too. And, uh, I want that Cindy tote. If y'all all know any, me at all, I, the Cindy tote is my favorite purse. I've got like three of them and uh, to have one in leather would be just perfect. So lots of other things happening. The gift guide, hopefully you've got that in your hands. I have been running an online party that I started toward the end of last month. Um, you know, everybody who places an order on this online party for my holiday gift guide is going to go into the drawings for the hostess rewards. So you can do something like that. All of those beautiful graphics are on 31 today under marketing materials and in the holiday marketing materials. So make sure you grab some of those to have some fun with. Um, and then, you know, we've got this new opportunity kit that's coming out. I am going to be running an opportunity event. I've actually got it set up already. We've already started adding some people to it. So make sure you tag me on Facebook. If you want me to add you to that opportunity event, if you've got a couple of ladies in mind and over the next few days, I'm gonna start ramping it up and really start, I'm talking a lot about getting women to sign up because there's so much going on in this month um, between that new uh, start swell where they do, if they do at least $500 in sales, they're going to earn 25% in business credit. <clears throat> then this thousand dollar incentive. So if they, if they do that, then they're going to get that Cindy tote. Um, and then everybody is going to be eligible to work toward the leadership incentive trip. They've changed some things this year to make it more within the reach of so many more ladies. It used to be that you had to earn the incentive trip by team sales. Now this incentive trip is totally in your hands because it's personal volume and recruiting. And if you recruit, if you um, promote yourself to director by the end of February, then you too could be on this incentive trip. So there's so many things happening right now to just make um, what you're doing fun. Now, if you're saying, hold up, uh, you know, Tammy, I'm really just in this for the fun, that's okay because there's still incentives in place for you to continue trying to, you know, to stay fun. So you still have to work your business even if you just want this as a hobby because you still have to stay active. So kind of pay attention. Don't shut out. If you're thinking, oh, those things are way beyond what I want to do, just, just keep watching because there's lots of fun things going to come up. Um, so wanted to go back to a few other things and I am going to be, you know, this is being recorded for you ladies who just kind of joined us. Um, I had shared some fun stuff, some things that are coming up. One of the things in October, oh, got to mute somebody. Okay, muted. Okay. Um, one of the things that you may not have seen is during the month of October, we're matching all Roundup donations to support Domestic Violence Awareness, Awareness Month up to $31,000. So in the U.S., it's going to be $31,000. In Canada, it's going to be $10,000. So really encourage your, your um, customers, your friends to round up. I think it's something we forget to talk about. Even in my Facebook parties, I'm talking about the Roundup. And um, so this month, you know, go and look for those graphics that you can talk about. Um, statistics, domestic, domestic violence, it, it's touched everybody's lives. And so talk about how when they round up, 31 is going to match it. So um, whether they are rounding up a penny or 10 bucks, it doesn't matter. Um, you know, it really is going to make a difference. So make sure you're talking about it because a lot of people, you know, when I'm, when I'm at a store or something and it says, do I want to, you know, donate such and such, and there's really no explanation about what that money's doing, I always say no. So make sure explaining, you're explaining to them exactly what that's about. I'm just going to, you know, fly through a couple of these things because another video that I want you guys to see. Um, <clears throat> if you're trying to book parties, really talk about this hostess bundle, this, uh, this stuff that's happening right now, where if they get up to a $600 party, they can choose up to three of these items at 70% off. Two people booked a party off of this. So make sure you're sharing, getting people excited. And then you can see that the, the double take tote is part of the exclusives. Um, and so with a 1200 party, they can get it for $40. Um, they can get it for free, but with a $1,200 party, they can get it for free, but for a party of $200 or more, they can get it for 40. I have two of them fell in love with this bag. I've got it in blue and black. So make sure you're sharing that. Um, <clears throat> the guide, is, this is a fun graphic you can share. If you haven't bought any yet, Make sure you're going on to 31 today into your business supplies and getting a handful of those. I've been having a good time with those. People love them. It's one of my favorite gift guys that we've had so far. Um, <clears throat> we'll talk about the special later. 
Remember, you can um, keep a party link open for two months now. So if you want to span two separate um, customer specials, that's what I did with the party that I have open right now. Started it last month. Those people who wanted to order the sale items and visit Top Utility Tote, they've already placed their orders. It's submitted. And then I'm going to continue taking orders until October 15th now with this, this um, holiday guide. And when it's time to close out, I have all those, those um, you know, the customer, the hostess rewards to, to, re to surprise somebody with. So make sure you're doing that. You know, every month have a party open. Um, you, do, you can keep it open for up to two months, but um, have a, um, that party going so that when people do go and place random orders, you can say, hey, will you place that order under my party link and then just make sure you hit direct ship so that they're gonna go ahead and get their order submitted. Of course, we already talked about this. Um, as part of the 15th year that we're celebrating, if you do at least that $1,000 in sales, you're gonna get this beautiful bag. And guys, don't forget the commission that comes with that. Um, that's $250 in commission. So don't, you know, that's, that's the, the best part of all of that. Um, <clears throat> okay. So one of the things that I wanted to remind you guys is, um, before we go back to Cindy's other video, is I'm hearing, a, you know, I don't know if you guys have been playing along. Some of you have. I'm going to go back through all the photos later. But I want you to continue booking. So find those pictures of your favorite candy and book those catalog parties, book those um, Facebook parties and home parties. Finally got another home party tonight booked. I'm so excited because I love the home parties. But if you're living in the Facebook parties, we're going to talk about really embracing those here in just a minute. Um, but I want to just show you this. I'm going to pull this up really quickly. This right here is um, ways to book a party and grow your business. I'm just going to read through some of them. Place a catalog in the teacher's lounge. Advertise in alumni newsletters. Place um, current customers and leads. Um, you know, make sure that they're getting your, your emails. Um, put a catalog in the break room. Give, a catal cat give catalogs to those receptionists, receptionists at the dentist and at the doctor. Every time I go to a doctor, whether it's for myself, for my kids, dentist, chiropractor, it doesn't matter. I bring in catalogs, bring in some cookies, bring in some candy, bring it with you. Um, have an open house. Uh, leave catalogs at any of your appointments. I take those mini catalogs, these little things, I'll take a handful of them and I'll slide them into catalogs that are already sitting out at the doctor's office. So when somebody's slipping through, they can find those minis. Do that, stick them in there. Have things on hand that you can pass out. Sometimes you can take um, a little mini catalog and a little zipper, you know, like a little plastic baggie and, and staple it, put your business card in there with maybe some little bag of M&Ms. Have those ready to hand the cashiers at the grocery store or the library, different places. Just hand it to them and say, hey, have you ever heard of 31? If they say yes, then ask them how. Don't let them just leave it there. Start those conversations. Um, hosting shows with your PTOs. Um, I'm just kind of going through this, and I can put this this link up on this page up on our team page. But basically, the purpose of this fly flyer is just to get you thinking. Um, you know, when somebody says to me, "I can't book a party," I want to ask them, "Well, what are you doing?" If you are just posting on social media, will you host a party for me? People are not going to do that. I have said that you know, a million times. They don't do it for me either. If I just randomly post on some social media somewhere, I need somebody to book a party. They're not going to respond to that because, um, you know, it's like me going into a crowded room and yelling, uh, will somebody host a party for me? For, will somebody host a baby shower for me? Why? Why would somebody just jump in and do that? They have to have a personal reason for it. They want to be invited. They want to make, they want to believe that you want them to be a part of their lives. So be specific. Call that friend. Hey, Angie, have you seen this new gift guide? I know you're thinking about Christmas shopping. Let's do a party so that you're not paying for these things. You can earn them for free at half price. Talk to your friends. Um, I've made three phone calls like that over the past week, and those people have said yes to catalog parties. So um, we're going to go back to the Better Together page that I have. We're going to watch another video from Cindy. And then I want to talk to you about um, embracing those Facebook parties because there's some things that I've been doing and I found a little bit of success in them and I want to share with you what I'm doing with those. So let me go back over here to this page. We're going to watch this. If I can get it to work this time. Hello ladies, I'm Andrea Dowling, Vice President of Merchandising. And joining me 
here today is Lou Petrero, my good friend, our vice president of sales. Hi, ladies, and hi, Andrea. How are you? Good, Lou. So glad to be here. Lou and I are teaming up today to share how you can use our holiday gift guide and online products, as well as our selling tools and marketing materials to help book more parties and work to increase your PE this season. But first, let's take another look at the new holiday gift guide and online exclusive styles, which we first revealed to your conference. so excited about these products, and we are too. Ladies, you already know that your customers and hostesses are shopping these next few months. They're looking for those gifts for not only friends and family, but teachers, service providers, and coworkers. This is her biggest shopping season, and she's looking for ways to save. And what's the best way we offer to save on all of those gifts? Host a party, of course. There is always a reason to party with 31, but during the holidays, the best reason is that she can use her hostess rewards to complete her own wish list and get some or even all of her gifts for free or half price. So as you're sharing our catalog or gift guide for parties, show her a page and tell her how she could earn everything on it when she hosts with you. Now don't forget to use your back office reports to reach out to hostesses who party with you last so when she parties with you this season, she doesn't have to drive to the mall, wait in long lines, and deal with selfish salespeople. Instead, she gets to party in the comfort of her own home with her friends or online and really enjoy that time with friends and family. That's right. We know the holidays are a busy time for all of us. You may prefer the ease of retail sales orders to help you reach your goals as the year winds down. But did you know that parties bring you, on average, more personal volume than retail sales do on your website. Now, you know that the best place to book your next party is at the party. Wouldn't you like to start booking 2018 now? Okay, Andrea, now that we've walked through some booking ideas, what are some ways to use our holiday products and tools to reach customers this year? So, of course, the biggest draw is our holiday gift guide and online exclusive. There is nothing as special as a personalized gift. And, ladies, we are an industry leader. Along with the gift guide, we've also created a fly to help you share our online exclusives at face-to-face -face parties, which directs customers to shop on your personal website. Now, you can order it from Vistaprint or download a copy on TOT. You'll also have the graphics and videos to share from the marketing material page. Plus, you can't forget the catalog refresh available to purchase on Vista Supply starting on October 15th. This new version of our fall winter catalog has a larger emphasis on gifting. Plus, new home organization spreads for all those decluttering resolutions and new year. And your mini catalogs are another way to share gifting <coughs> ideas on the go. Start with the best of fall mini catalogs for easy gift ideas, or consider mailing them to your best customers. You'll find even more holiday ideas throughout the season on our Ideas We Love page on My31, with new videos and articles posted every single month. If you attended the conference in July, you might remember that we introduced a new method for sharing 31 on your social media accounts and your VIP Facebook pages called the Conversation Cafe. It's a simple way for you to plan ahead and map out new conversation starters on social for each day or even each week. Soon you'll receive your next issue of Virtuous Women magazine, which always includes a pull-out calendar with important dates for your business. Spend some time filling out your own personal conversation calendar, including our new gifting style and our fall winter catalog. We've always said, when you work your business a little each day, you'll create consistent habits that can lead to a consistent, predictable income for your business. And this is the best way to do that. So take advantage of your two ways to party, both online and face-to-face, -face, as you work around your customer schedule. It's also a time of year when you can utilize other ways to party, like vendor shows in your community. We have a great article in your new issue of VW that gives you tips on how to do just that. Andrea, what other products can she leverage with you? We have some great specials coming up. Right now, your hostesses can save 70% on up to three gift guide items with a $600 plus party. Another reason. 
you can get those with you this month and get an early start on the holiday shopping. And then in November, they can get the two piece perfect party bundle, which includes a twice as high coat and the perfect party set for just $25 in the US and $31 in Canada. She can choose from three prints, including the new Chevron Dash and the new Frosted Metallic. Yeah. It is one of my favorites, yeah. which is only available in these styles as part of the special. We also have some exciting news that you may have already heard. We're bringing back our always popular medium utility codes as a November customer special. Customers can get up to two medium utility codes or medium sample inserts with a qualifying purchase. This is the one product customers ask for year after year. So reach out to your past customers who purchased an MUT and let them know they can get a matching insert or a new MUT in seven prints including two new prints from the gift guide and the new frosted metallic. These specials are all about exclusivity. She can't get these products on special any other time of the year. So now is the time for her to shop or host with you. So when you do have the products, you have the tools, all that's left is to share them with your customers and hostesses and make this season your best one. Yes. So have fun partying and happy holidays from Lou and I. Bye, everybody. Okay, so I want to show you, hopefully, am I still hear me okay? We're good? Okay. If you look under scoop and um, marketing, I um, want to say that that flyer should, let's see if I can find it for you very quickly. I think this might be it online exclusive flyer they didn't put these into business um, supply because they can just find these products on the website um but if you want to they're very easy just to print so let's see yeah i can just print it i think it should print just fine i'm going to print it and see how the colors look um but that's where these extra things are. If you're just wondering, you know, why aren't they in the gift guide? Well, these are just extra online specials. So in here, you've got a couple of different colors of the Your Way rectangle. And um, let's see if I can zoom in. Let's zoom that in. Um, there's the blanket. There's the cookie set. The two the two aprons that black Cindy tote. Um, absolutely in love with this Ruby Mini. I oh my word, you guys, I love this. And then down here, this is all about the Benjamins in the Rose Glow Pebble. Definitely going to have to buy that for myself. I've already got this in my cart, the Silver City Lights Clutch. Um, there's just so many beautiful things. So go ahead and, you know, make sure you get familiar with those products because they're just amazing. So one of the things that I really wanted to focus on tonight is embracing the Facebook party. And I wanted to show you something that I've been doing is really getting to use my, um, my survey monkey. And so um, I'm going to unmute you. If you want to say something, let me know. I only muted everybody because there's a lot of background noise. But at a party, you know, you're meeting people, you're getting their orders, so you're getting all of their information, and you're taking it home with you. But for a Facebook party, what happens? They come, they go, half of them don't order, maybe sometimes more than half of them don't order. And you've got zero contacts. So you have nobody to follow up on. So I was talking to Brandy at home office and she said, you need to start making it where those people are introduced to you just like you would do at a party. So couldn't figure out how to get the hostess to understand that, to get them to help me get to know them. So what I've started doing is a door prize. I came up with a really quick survey and um, it just has a couple of questions on it. So I'm going to click on this one that I did for this last party. 10 of her friends filled it out. So that's 10 contacts that I can follow up with. Um, and let me see, I'll show you what it says. I'm just using SurveyMonkey. You do use whatever you like. So the first part says, you know, door prize survey for Alice's fall fun, giveaway time. And I just want their information, name, first and last address, email, phone number. I want all of that. Number two, thanks for the invite after the party. I hope to connect. Um, please tell me more about hosting my own Facebook party. 
What is your hostess of the month club? Let me see after this party what I meet, might need, and can you tell me more about starting my own 31 journey? Most of them are choosing, let me see after the party. The last question, what draws your interest the most? And I have fall fashion, organization, best of the catalog, or not sure. The reason I'm asking that is because every single person that fills this in, I'm sending a little note in the mail with a mini catalog. If they say fall fashion, I'm sending them a mini catalog that says the fashionista. If they say organization, I'm sending them the mini catalog about organization. If they say best of the catalog, I'm sending them the one that has the fall best. If they say um, not sure yet, then I'm just choosing them the fall best. I'm just sending that one to them. And so, because obviously we can't afford to send every single person a full size catalog, that seems to be really helping. And it's kind of opening the door for me to give them a call. And I'm calling every single one of them that leave a phone number for me. And so I'm following up with them, seeing how I can help. Um, I booked a potential, I don't have, I say potential because I don't have the date yet, but a potential fundraiser being able to do, being able to call them like that. So the way that I'm getting them to fill this in on Facebook is I'm telling them for every five people that fill it out, I do a drawing. So we got to the first five and we did a drawing. We got to the next 10 and we got to 10. I did another drawing. So the, the hostess is, is encouraging her friends to fill it in and I'm encouraging them to fill it in. So you really have to get the hostess to get them excited about filling this in. Now, when it's time to create one for my next question, party, so let's say I want to work on my, my next hostess is Anna. I'm not going to, I'm not going to redo the whole thing. What? I have a question. Uh huh. Where are you posting this survey? Are you emailing it or are no, you Facebook, um, Facebook. in the Facebook party? Okay. Okay. Yeah. I have like a, just a, a picture of like some, something silly and you know, and I keep, I posted, I usually post, post it again, like two or three times. Like, don't forget, don't forget. So within my survey on survey monkey, I don't redo it every single time. I just go up here to create a survey and then I choose copy existing survey. And I'm just going to use this one that I did for Alice. And then I'm going to put copy survey. Give it a second. It's duplicating it. Now here you see it says copy. So I need to go in and move you all out of the way. I need to go in here and edit it, get rid of copy. So I, I get rid of the copy of, because it always adds that in. And then all I do is I go over here and I put door price survey for Anna's. And I think we're calling it holiday fun instead of fall fun. And that's all I have to change. So I'm going to save that. So door prize survey for Anna's hol holiday fund. And then it's saved. And then it gives me the link. So I get my link. And then I could go and copy that link to her party. So I will do this every single time. And what that does is it, it allows me to separate my, I don't use the same link. Like I recreate it every time. So that way in my dashboard, it's all separated. There's Anna's party. There's my quarter auction ladies, my October fun, door prize for Alice's party, door prize for Juliana's party, Christmas club. And so they're all separated. So I don't forget, um, you know, who that customer belonged to. So whether you're using Google's or whatever Google's, I sound like an old person, whether you're using Google or whatever you're using, um, you know, have a title for each party. And you guys, this has been, you know, I've been fighting against Facebook parties, but about two or three weeks ago, I decided it was time for me to embrace it and just make the best of them. So I don't know if you noticed, like behind me, I have like a table and I've started doing my parties in my office like I'm at their house. So I set the whole thing up. I'm pulling out products. I'm sharing. I go live three times. I do like the purses on one live video, then I do all the thermals on another video, then I do another video of whatever the customer specials or whatever it is. Um, so if I'm going to have to embrace these Facebook parties, I'm going all in. I'm not really great at scripts. That's why I'd rather just go live. So if you're not great at going live, then, then go to, you know, 31today.com and under that learn section in the middle, they've got a whole section on doing Facebook parties. So you can check that out. Um, 
so anyways, I hope that helps. My time is almost up because you know when I record it, it um, gives me a, a very brief time frame that I can keep going. But do you guys, um, I'm going to unmute just if anybody has any questions. Oh, somebody's noisy. Never mind. Um, you tell me if you have any questions, then I'll unmute you. But I'm excited. I think this is a great month. Yes, Susie. Um, can uh, we please schedule a one-on-one -on -one or something for me to understand the whole um, survey thing? Because you know I struggle with that. Yeah, in fact, I think I made a video. I was trying to find it. I thought I had made a training video on how to actually set up Sur um, Survey Monkey, but absolutely. Okay. Um, and I'm getting better and better at it too. The more I play with it, the better I'm getting at it. Like I'm finding more tricks to make it work easier for me. For me. Um, and if you're really smart, there's like a whole graphic section that tells you exactly like what answer, what questions were answered the best. And I don't do all that. I'm not that good. I just go, yes, 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 yes. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, but it works. And I feel like, you know, that's the biggest thing is with these Facebook parties, we're just not meeting people. Um, so you have, you know, 20 people RSVP, three people order, and there's 17 contacts. You don't, you don't even know who they are. So I'm going to, you know, I've got, I think 10 Facebook parties in October. And my plan is to get at least 10 contacts out of each and every single one of those parties. So it takes a lot, it takes a lot more hostess coaching. Um, it takes making sure the hostess shows up for the parties. It takes making sure the hostess actually invites people and gets them excited. It takes making sure the hostess doesn't, you know, dump 450 contacts into the party and none of them want to be there. So I've actually started encouraging them to only invite 15 and get the rest from blasting social media and saying who wants to be invited, you know, because they'll add 40 friends who want nothing to do with it instead of just saying, who would like to be invited to my party? The most successful Facebook parties I have are the ones where the hostess goes out and says, having a 31 party, who wants to be at it? Those are the best parties because they've requested to be in it and they place orders. So find ways to just get people interacting um, and just, you know, keep asking because <clears throat> October by far is usually the highest amount of sales for Christmas because people are like jumping in like, head first for holiday shopping. So uh, have fun with that. Anyway, so tomorrow night, we're, um, I have a couple ladies on here. To, we're going to be with us tomorrow night, but we're going to go over a few different things tomorrow night. But for just the month, I hope everybody, everybody will get excited. Um, keep booking those parties and, and throwing up those pictures of candy on our team page. I'm going to do the drawings for our two beautiful bracelets as soon as all of my back office stuff is is back up because it's all down right now while they're running commissions. Um, so we'll see who our two winners are. Um, haven't decided what I'm giving away this month, but I think it should be something fun. We'll figure that out. But I'm, I'm hoping that everybody will just aim for that thousand dollar Cindy tote and just get that and that'll be the best. Anyway, so my time is up. So before I get turned off because Zoom's about to come in here and be like, you're out. Does anybody have any questions for me? Would the dog like to ask any questions? No. <laughs> it's such a cute dog. So cute. Hold on. The there you Wait. go. What's wrong with the puppy? He said, my mommy's going to Punta Cana tomorrow and oh. Miss Susie's watching me. <laughs> where, are you, where are you staying? At the Rio Republica Bavaro. That's, oh, that's going to be fun. It's free. I don't choose. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Susie's getting him tomorrow. That's a cute dog. Right. That is a really yeah. cute dog. And he is lovable, big time. Yeah.